Port Monmouth, opened during World War I, served the Army and the nation well for 94 years before closing in 2011. Now the old base has been given a new mission to house families left homeless by Hurricane Sandy. This is the first building that the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is refurbishing for that purpose. This is building 365 located at Fort Monmouth. This is the location where the renovations are taking place. Right now the contractors are working on a 12-hour, 7-day-a-week project schedule. The first day of construction was November 27th. The scope of the project is to convert 60 of the existing one-bedroom units into 45 units total, with 15 being converted into three-bedroom and nine being converted into ADA accessible. This is one of our first floor units. It involves the conversion of two one-bedroom units into a three-bedroom unit. It also includes changing the door openings and shower location into an ADA accessible unit. I just did a few sketches just showing which units would be modified, you know, in terms of bathroom fixtures, kitchenette fixtures, um, redoing the carpet and some of the finishes. So basically that's all happened in the past two or three weeks, so it's been very quick getting it together, but everything seems to be coming along well and pretty quickly, so we're just here doing a walkthrough just to check on the progress of the work and see how it's being executed. I think of December the job is scheduled to be completed. Probably a few days before that, FEMA will come in with the furnishings, which includes beds and night tables and kitchen tables and chairs and everything you would find in any house. The idea is to finish the building, finish the furnishings, and have people moved in by the 20th of December in time for Christmas. The whole project is has affected everybody here personally because this is a disaster that's stricken us close to home and it's our fellow New Jerseyans that we're trying to help. 